Good morning again on this cold and frosty morning. My name's Rowan and this, this is just a quick update on my comparison experiment between uh, pots, grow bags and growing in the soil with potatoes. Um, okay, so I'll give you just a, a quick look at what's happening and um, the next video will be when I harvest them. Okay, so here we are. I've pulled the pots out from where they were because of these, these feral plum trees were shading them too much. So um, they get a bit more sun here. So as you can... Well, first of all, I should mention that when they were, say, this high, they did get eaten off. Some of the plants did get eaten off by, I assume, the wallaby that I sometimes find in here. But they've grown back again. So here's a, a look at the different ones. So here's a look at how they're growing. The plants in the ground are doing the worst. Even though I dug um, the same compost and, and cow manure into the soil, uh, they did get a setback from some bugs that live in the soil uh, red-legged earth mites and the bug that I have that that uh, skeletonizes their leaves. I'm, I don't know what it is. I haven't been able to catch it in traps, but so they did get a setback. But even after all that, the plants are way smaller than the ones in the tubs. Over here are the plants in the big plastic pots. They're doing marvelously well hugely better than all the others. Um, they've been flowering for a while now. In about 10 days um, I should be able to harvest a couple of tubers to show you what they're like if you harvest them a month after flowering. Now on this side over here if you can see them are the ones in the grow bags. These, these ones are doing a lot better than the ones in the ground and not quite as good as the ones in the plastic pots and I'm not really sure why. Um, they had the same amount of soil, the same types of soils. We haven't had hot dry days to dry the soil out so much so um, there's not been as much evaporation from the sides of the, the grow bags. The only thing I can think of is that Maybe potatoes just don't like air pruning of their roots. I can't see any other reason why the ones in the same size grow bags are not quite doing as good as the ones in the big plastic pots. Um, oh, there was one other thing I had to mention. Oh, watering. I've kept an eye on the soil um, moisture levels in all of these. I haven't had to water the ones in the ground, they've stayed moist. The ones in the big plastic pots I've watered a couple of times. The ones in the grow bags I've had to water a couple of extra times on top of that because of the way the water evaporates from the sides of the pots to keep up the same moisture level. Uh, so that's basically um, the update on this experiment. And as I said, uh, when they're ready to be harvested, then I will do another video. And we'll compare the, the um, uh, how many tubers and how big the tubers are. Okay, so uh, see you later. And um, I hope you come back for the next video.